So here's a here's a cheap way to uh, kind of integrate streaming audio into um, your old school analog audio gear. There's a couple of things that I work with that they're fine. They, they seem to get a decent sound. They're easy to use, um, and uh, best of all, they're, they're they're quite cheap. So if you're a Mac person, um, you might want to use airplay um but it's you know you don't have to be a mac person but so if you want to get airplay going cheaply to your um audio equipment what you can do is get one of these old um airport uh express i think they were called um they're still kicking around you can pick them up for 20 30 bucks um and what's interesting about them is that they have a, a jack in the back that's both the old analog style headphone jack but you can also use a fiber optic cable, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. So you have the standard. So I'm just using a standard headphone jack, mini 3.5 mini jack, they call it, to your regular RCA analog inputs. Um, put this guy on, his, on the network. Uh, it's pretty straightforward to set up. There's a bunch of stuff on the web for doing that. So what should happen is that when you're using something like Spotify, if you look at Spotify, it prompts you to, allows you to connect. To different devices so in my case um, I should see something under airplay so if I go under airplay I should see something I called mine the right here so if I click that and if I connect to that then what it's doing is it's streaming the audio to this device which is converting it to has a built-in DDA converts it to analog and then you plug it in so I should if I'm lucky it should be playing of course it's my luck it doesn't be playing <laughs> let me pause for a second. Let me get this going. Hang on. Okay, so I've got, I've got to go in there. Sorry for about the delay. Um, so yeah, so I'm running. I don't want to play this too long because it probably end up cutting off the copyrights. But so what I've told the Spotify is I want to stream to AirPlay. And so from my AirPlay, basically I just select it, boom, and it's now listening to. So I'm now streaming my music. Uh, from my phone so I can change music whatever do everything to from my iPhone to the Apple device to my stereo and that's it so uh, that's pretty straightforward now the other device that I like to use which doesn't isn't made anymore but you can find them on the used market is this little puck here from Google so this is the audio cast Google um, or they call it Chrome, it's not Chrome, Chrome Audio or something like that. Anyways, it, 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 it's not the video one, it's only for audio. So it, it has a uh, USB, it's powered by a USB uh, brick, which you know, so it, it takes very little power. And it too has just a standard headphone jack, uh, mini headphone jack, which and you can use any old one. And again, plugs into the back of your analog. So what that one does, same thing, you join it to your network and it will... Um, show up also on your iPhone. I'm assuming, again, you can, from the, if you have a Samsung, then this is more useful for Samsung, but you can do this with both a Samsung phone or, or an iPhone. Um, when you select, say, okay, I, 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 you know, you want to select another input. So in this case, I'm doing AirPlay. I want to change that. So inside of Spotify, um, I can select, uh, there should be an option to see the Chrome here. Let me see if it shows up here. Just give me a second. Of course, I'm always, come on, cancel this, get out of here. I'm looking for, there it is, good. So I've called, in this case, I've called it the uh, Google Cast. So I'm calling it the Garage Speaker. And if it connects, it should. And then I switch my input to the other auxiliary, which so now I'm listening to the, the Chromecast guy. I hit play, boom. So now I'm listening to this device here and it's now casting as a Chromecast. Um, so the nice thing about this is that you can actually do, with the Chrome guy, you can actually, if you're listening to things like um, YouTube music inside of a Google Chrome browser, whether you have a Mac browser or whether you have a, uh, a Windows browser, you can use the Google Chrome uh, audio cast and you can cast it to here and listen to computer music um, wirelessly through to you can stream it to here and listen to it on your regular stereo so it's very that's uh, very useful if you have a mac 
computer and you want to listen to whatever's playing on your Mac computer, you can tell the, the Mac computer to stream, uh, to airplay it to this device. And again, you can listen on your computer. So those are just a couple of really sort of simple ways to kind of improve your music experience um, with regards to streaming devices.